cutting out the first sheet. Made the first cuts on the boat. And we have cut wine to celebrate. So I'm going to give the first bit of cut wine to the boat. Very generous to the poor boat. There we go. Cat wine. Drink it up. Drink, drink up that. Drink it up. All right, I'll wipe that off actually. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, cut the system. No, that's why I'm going to. All right. That's the main cut. Cheers to the lovable scamp, whatever its name may be. Probably John Drum. Probably John. Lovely. It's a little bit fruity for my taste, but. Mm. Uh, Cheers! <laughs> I always drink when I'm using power tools. Nubs up, Australia! <laughs> First seat top cut out. So I've cut out the second bench top and like this sort of funny shaped piece here with the cockpit combing and the front of the whole bottom hanging out there. So I finished cutting out the cockpit combing piece. It's down there on the floor. Lovely. Well, more or less lovely. I messed up a little bit uh, along here. I accidentally cut on the wrong side of the line. And I kind of I tried to fix it up here, but uh, you can see the damage is already done. So that's going to be like a mil and a half out. How annoying. But I'll just have to fix that up when I get to it. Just fill the holes with epoxy or whatnot. Now we have this somewhat ridiculous looking piece. Very pointy. That side. The front of the bottom panel. That's what's left to cut out of the marine ply. I have a bunch of stuff to cut out here as well, but I'm not going to do that because as you can see, it's almost 2100. Now, I just need to cut this last little piece. And that'll be done cutting for today. So, that's it for the cutting for today. And I have to show for it one front part, one cockpit combing down here, and a bunch of little bits. Little bits. So I've cut out both pieces of the bottom piece. The back part, which is this part, the front part, which is that part, and they should match up. And they more or less do. I mean, they match up enough, I think. Let's go take a look. So, it looks kind of like this sticks out, but the reason for that is because I just kind of continued this line straight on, but of course it would have curved. So, this will need to get trimmed, that's fine. They're not quite matching up 100% here. The rear part is sticking out a little bit. Hmm, that's fine. I'll just... I'll leave these bits and I'll sort of maybe I'll just temporarily screw them together and then fare that together or something to make it nice and sweet. Same on this side. A little bit sticking out here but where actually the 2400 line is which is here 
and I've aligned that with the 2400 line on the bottom, it matches up to within about a mil. But the same thing, this uh, keeps going a little bit. Chipping away at it, chipping away. Mmm, lovely jubbly.